สวัสดีค่ะ Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm gonna show you guys uh, how I cook stir fry chicken bread with egg noodle and vegetable. We go look. <laughs> Here is the uh, ingredient I use: hoisin wok sauce. I like this sauce. I've been trying one time already. It's really good. The sauce tastes a little bit sweet, so you don't need any more sugar in your food because this sauce is already sweet. This is for stir fry. This tastes really good. You can find in the supermarket where you buy food and go to zone Asian food. Then you're gonna find this blue dra dragon. Okay. And chicken breast I make with um, mushroom sauce and black pepper and dark soy sauce mix together and leave it a uh, vegetable I take what I like I cook I add in what I like you can add in any kind of vegetable you like a uh, mushroom sauce oyster sauce and noodle I already boil it it take four to five minutes to cook kind of noodle I buy is uh, egg noodle I buy from food company uh, I cook only two two pieces it take four to five minutes if you cook whole lot whole pack take 20 minutes you can follow the instruction on the packet because this from cook not so expensive I think it's a very good price that's why I picked this one <laughs> okay now we go look how I cook here I use olive oil it's around two tablespoons so I gonna fry onion first you know if you like uh, garlic you can add in also but for me it's not really important to use garlic with fried egg noodle This one is a uh, celery because I like to eat. If you don't like it, you don't need to use it. You don't need to add it. Fry vegetable until vegetable soft. After that, you can add in chicken breast. You can transfer out to the plate if you want to, but for me, I leave in here. I still keep the vegetable on the pan. It's not a problem. My kitchen is very really small. <laughs> little bit uncomfortable to cook sometimes. But it's okay, I can manage. <laughs> I live in the caravan. It's not the same uh, house. Kitchen in the house, big. So you have space to do this and that. Now I'm gonna put a uh, vegetable on the side, like this. And then I'm gonna fry chicken here. Now she can start to cook. See? And you can mix everything together. Mix in the vegetable together. Now I add in the mushroom. Champignon. Because mushroom is easy to cook, so you don't need to fry before chicken. Now you see mushroom start to be soft. So now we can uh, add in sauce. Now I'm gonna add in the noodle first. This 
is a lot of noodles. I'm gonna add a uh, mushroom sauce. This one. But I'm not measure, I only pour it in like this. But for you, if you're not sure, you take two tablespoons. Because my way, I I know how much I need. And my oyster, oyster sauce. Always take two tablespoons first. Green onion. Now, hoisin sauce. Really important. <laughs> I use whole pack because it's quite a lot of noodle and chicken. But this pack you don't throw away yet. You need to fill in water. Open up like this. Open up like this. And fill in water about here. Do you see? About here. When you fill in water, check check a little bit. And then you pour it on here. So now you can I feel a little bit uncomfortable when I'm cooking because my cooker is really small and sometimes my cooking pan a little bit slippery <laughs> when I try to stir. But I gonna try try you know like find a way. To, to stir everything together <laughs> smell really really delicious because the salt in the pack give you more flavor that's why I like to use it now sauce start to be thick you can see If you like black pepper, you can add also, or white pepper. But for me, I already add black pepper in the chicken meat, so I don't need to add more. Now, start to dry out a bit now. Tastes very good. Here yeah, is really simple Thai, Thai food if you like um, egg noodle stir fry egg noodle with chicken bread or you can use beef if you like for me chicken is really easy here <laughs> smell gorgeous as you see in the photo in the video i love this menu <laughs> okay guys see you next time bye bye